Hey guys, quick video on service brake failure for a 2020 Chevy Silverado Custom 1500, 2020 and up. Uh, ran across this issue after I did my front and also rear brake pad change. I looked at a few videos, but I couldn't find any that would help me out. Um, a couple codes came up and I couldn't go over 43 miles per hour and I was like, man, what's going on? I did everything right, put the sensor on right, brake pads on right, but the code came up. So what I came to the conclusion was I reset the system. So I disconnected the battery terminal, the negative and the positive. I waited for 10 minutes and I waited for 10 minutes and it went away and I took test drove it to test it out and i'll just show you if you don't know uh where the battery is located and also how to disconnect it first off you want to pop your hood your battery box is located underneath this right here so what i did was this clip here clip here sorry engine made a little dusty but here's your battery located here's your negative terminal and your positive terminal now i thought i had to take all this off but you don't so what i did was i had got a deep socket 10 millimeter um i took off this right here this bolt and also unscrewed this one to loosen it up off this terminal and then this is tab right here that you just lift up and then this whole portion right here comes this whole portion right here just comes off so I disconnected the negative right here and also the positive right here. And then once you do the positive side, you just lift up on this right here. This tab, it'll come up and this whole little portion right here will just move to the side. And I just took it off the terminals for about 10 minutes. I did 10 minutes. I don't know, it may do it in five, but I did it in 10. I let it sit for 10 minutes. Then I hooked everything back up and started the truck and the codes went away i test drove it it drives over 45 miles per hour or 43 miles per hour and also um it breaks fine so hopefully this helps someone out i was freaking out because i was like man i gotta take it to the dealership but it saved me a lot of money uh saved me some time and hopefully this can help somebody out in the long run thanks